Hey guys, now some of you who's been following me for a while, you know that I'm very direct. But whatever I say to you, it comes from the right place, from a good place, with a lot of love. And there's one big thing that's been on my mind a lot lately, these last few months, when I look at what guys are doing. Even guys that I know personally. And this one thing gives you a bad name. And it influences all your relationships. You can be a good guy. Look presentable, kind, positive, have good manners, be well-dressed, and always be there when someone needs you. But if you do this one thing, it can destroy all the other things in an instant. In most cases, guys don't even know. They don't see how this influences the way that other people see them. You might just brush it off and think, oh, well, it's fine, they understand. Meantime, they just don't want to say anything because they don't want to create a scene. The way they look at you as a person changes totally. And this one thing is so important because it influences your name. And at the end of the day, your name is all you really have. Shannon Alder said, carve your name on hearts, not tombstones. A legacy is etched into the minds of others and the stories they share about you. So, what is this one thing that can give you a bad name? Not being a man of your word. There are many men today who do not keep their promises, even when it comes to things like, I'll bring it to you on Monday, or I will help you with that next week, or I'll visit you on Saturday, or I'll call you tomorrow. But then they do not keep their word, so they break trust. And trust is one of the rarest things that you can find in this world. Words carry weight. So think before you say anything to anyone. Your yes should always be yes and your no, no. Jesus said in Matthew 5 verse 37, let what you say be simply yes or no. Anything more than this comes from evil. If you don't keep your word, it is disgusting. Think about it. Whenever someone promises you something and they don't keep their word, how do you feel? You don't feel great, right? So why do you do it to other people? Whenever somebody promises me something and if they don't keep their promise, I don't mention it. I just ignore it, but I never look at that person the same again because I won't trust them the same way I used to. I forgive them because we have to forgive people, right? because we all have sinful fleshly natures. There's nobody that's perfect in this world. But forgiveness and trust, those are two different things. So think about the man, the type of man you are right now and the type of man you wanna be and start working towards that. Real men are men who keep their promises, who keep their word. So be a man of your word. And always remember, life is short, so don't waste. Yours. Cheers, guys.